These days, artificial intelligence seems to be on everybody's minds. But what actually is artificial intelligence and what does it mean to study it at Rosenheim Technical University of Applied Sciences? Professor Dr. Marcel Tilly, head of the new bachelor's degree program Applied Artificial Intelligence, will answer these and other questions in the following interview. What is artificial intelligence? In artificial intelligence, we teach computers to see, to hear, to understand and to learn. And this is all based on data. This means, for example, if you have a photo, we can teach computers or a computer can learn what is this photo about, what the scene is telling me. For example, there is a cow standing on a green field or you have a movie. The computer finally can summarize a movie, can understand what this movie is about. It can understand or learn to understand when someone is talking and it can translate it to a different language, for example. We can even do more. We can empower computers to compose new music, to write new text, or even to paint a new picture. This is basically what artificial intelligence is about. In what context is AI applied and why is it such an interesting field in the future? I think you can apply artificial intelligence to almost every domain. There's a broad spectrum of, of capabilities where you can use it. Let's take industry, for example. You can have visual quality checks at the end of a manufacturing process to decide either product is good or bad. Or you can use it for guiding um, AJVs, autom autonomous guided vehicles, to move around in a in the, in, on the shop floor. You can use it in, in medicine or health. Let's assume you have people who are handicapped. You can have them supported when they talk. You can use speech recognition systems, which enable them to communicate with others. Or you can have more AI systems, which are applied to, to text and text understanding. Then you can use it in, in domains like um, contracts, where you have to con a lot of contracts. It can summarize contracts. Um, you can compare patterns, or you have it even in marketing, or, well, the, the simplest example is to support search engines and um, to come up with the best ranking results for you, right? Which career opportunities are possible after completing this degree? Artificial intelligence is diverse, and so job opportunities are. I would say as a software engineer, you can work or you can apply your artificial intelligence skills to it by bringing machine learning models into production. You have a specific AI model, which is about opt image recognition, and it needs to be applied into the software development process, finally to get into production on a device for the production line, for example. Or you can work as a data scientist. A data scientist is more into data, right? As the name says. So you learn from data, you understand, or you teach your computer to learn from data, to understand what is in the data, and from there you, you are able, you are capable to derive new business opportunities from it. These are two examples of job opportunities. Finally, I would say as a graduate of, the, of our bachelor's program, you, you have a broad range of job opportunities available, and this applies globally and regionally. What are the key objectives of the AAI Bachelor's Degree Program? Our key objective is actually to make you an AI expert with practical experience. This means you can take all these AI models and put them into production, independent of the industry and domain. How is the study program structured? The study program is structured around mathematics, computer science, software engineering and artificial intelligence modules. MAS is building the foundation for, for this program. You learn everything you need to understand modern algorithms in artificial intelligence. Computer science is teaching you how to program um, and how to, how to, to operate programs. Software engineering is 
applying practical experiences from projects, project management and so on to it. And the AI modules are teaching you all the popular algorithms um, around machine learning, deep learning and so on. How does this bachelor's degree differ from a computer science degree? Compared to the computer science degree, this degree has more math, more mathematics foundations, and a lot more um, artificial intelligence modules. So you learn about supervised, unsupervised learning, reinforcement learning, you have specific modules for speech recognition and um, computer vision. This is definitely different to a computer science degree in this sense. Do I have to be a math genius to study AAI? Well, you don't have to be a genius to study AAI and in math. Um, but definitely you should not be afraid of it. Why is it worth studying in Rosenheim and why should I apply? Studying in Rosenheim is a great thing to do. Um, first of all, we have a huge startup community around here in, in the region. So there are plenty of job opportunities in the midterm. And um, Rosenheim is also located pretty close to Munich as a huge area. And you know, in Munich, we have all the big companies from various industries. And well, I would say last but not least, Rosenheim is a lovely place to be. Um, it's next to the Alps and it's one of the most beautiful areas in Germany. So I don't think there's any reason not to come to Rosenheim. So come here. <laughs>